Hey everybody and welcome back to Investment Honey where we talk about various crypto projects. Before we begin, I want to let you know that I'm not your financial advisor. I do not provide financial advice on the channel and I don't even encourage you to invest. But what I am going to do is share with you my own personal opinion and views on the projects discussed on the channel. So with that said, we're looking at Mobula. This is a decentralized data aggregator. It says here that anybody should be able to query reliable data about any crypto token easily directly on chain. Imagine coin market cap owned by you. So if you click on the launch, launch alpha button here, it's going to take you here so you can kind of see what they've done and what they've developed. And I think it looks pretty good. Um, so kind of reminds you coin market cap, right? So some things coming soon, you know, but uh, this is basically what it looks like. So I do like, you know, what they've got going on here. Uh, it does look, uh, looks like they're headed in the right direction as far as I'm concerned. So um, we see here that it says it's a unique uh, protocol, the heart of uh, decentralization. Data is the backbone of any ecosystem, which I would agree. Um, Abula's protocol enables the implementation of a new kind of data aggregator accessible on chain. Almost uh, all EVM compatible blockchains making data integrated completely decentralized, and you can discover the white paper. So. If we look at the white paper, we've got a lot of different uh, things to engage with concerning the white paper. So just making you know, aware that that is there, a lot of information to access uh, there. Cross-chain, so it's going to be cross-chain supporting almost all EVM compatible blockchains such as ETH, BSC, and Polygon. It's on-chain, it's decentralized as well. And then we can see as far as on-chain on -chain APIs, integrating seamless data made possible. Data processed by Mobula is easily integratable on any platform. A simple free API called now separates uh, decentralized applications from access to data that is consistent with the Web3 philosophy. Transparent data from a decentralized source. And they got to read our docs you know, button there that just takes you to the white paper. And then here, uh, enter the Mobula DAO. Governed by the community, data shouldn't be controlled by centralized institution. I think a lot of people would agree with that. And inspired by the greatest, uh, or by the greatest, Mobula's DAO allows any holder to govern in proportion to his shares, or his or her shares. One can vote, create proposals that will be discussed by the community, and then uh, be accepted or rejected. So, we've also got a link here for the Discord. Trusted by, you know, a number of backers and integrators that they list here. And then join the movement. Uh, and so we've got just some different links you can engage with there, including a whitelist link too that I'll leave in the description for you. So that takes us through, um, you know, what Mabula is. Just want to go ahead and do a quick video, you know, on that. Um, the team is partially docs, you know, but you'll have to go ahead and reference the white paper to view that. So uh, just be aware of that. Uh, but beyond that, I don't really have anything else to add, you know, on this one. Um, don't think that I've seen an audit, you know, on this project yet either, so I can't really speak to any severity issues concerning the uh, contract code there. Just want to go ahead and you know, state that transparently. So uh, I don't have anything else to add on this project. You know, as always, go ahead and make sure that you engage with the white paper if you're interested in learning more. And, you know, this channel is uh, making is about making sure that you are informed in terms of your level of participation in any crypto projects and make sure that you're not just aping in, you know, taking interest you know, to a project based on what you heard on the YouTube video. Make sure that you're developing your own signals before you decide to go ahead and lean into or away from any project. Um, you know, concerning cryptocurrency participation and activity. With that said, thank you guys so much for watching the video. If you're not yet a subscriber, please subscribe. Um, I will leave the relevant links for this project in the description. And I thank you so much for uh, watching this content for this video and continuing to support the channel. Can't grow this channel without you guys. Thank you so much.